John. Um, okay. I think you surprised him. I think I did too. It's kind of hard to do. Yeah. Congratulations, by the way. Thank oh, you. Thank, well. thank you very much. I hope you're happy about this. Why? I look unhappy? I don't know. No, I'm very happy. I'm, I'm glad that you two are finally um, taking this step. Good, good. Because I know that you and Barbara, you wouldn't... Yes, to... yes, we've had our differences, mm. and we've got a long way to go, but now that she's going to be my stepmom... Oh, for uh, crying out loud, no, don't I'm say something try, like John. that. I am. I know how much you care for her, and, and I hope that someday Barbara and I can be friends. Good, because I know she's going to try as well. Um, I want nothing more than the two of you to be very mm. happy. Thank you. The three of you. <laughs> now, I, you. I gotta get to work. Really? Mm -hmm. Really, I do, because I called a little while ago. I told him I wouldn't be in after 11, and it's getting late, and I gotta okay. go. So. Well, I, I thank you for dropping by. All right. Party on, John. Mm -hmm. Bye. Mm -hmm. You know, um, she means that. Yeah, I hope so. So, uh, uh, how, how about... Our sure. shoes? Yeah, sure. Oop, oop. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I was... Uh, I'm gonna make a little bit of a toast here. Just... I figured, so you know what you're gonna say? <laughs> huh? For the toast, you know what you're gonna say? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. I, I got that all... I got it all worked out. Good. Uh, then thanks for the, for the drink. Thank you. Now, what exactly are we looking for here? Um, something that the police might have in the files about the fire when David Allen's parents died. Yeah, right. So the newspaper said they suspected arson, right? Right. How come David's parents died, but, but he got out? Think he was the arsonist? Well, that must have been an investigation. Yeah. We should have asked Alan's aunt about it. No, no, no. She would have been way too suspicious. But hey, if we strike out here, we can always go back. Marco! Oh, Chief Munson, sir! Uh, hi, Marco. Get a little promotion, did we? Yeah, right. Maybe in 30 years, huh? Uh, this is my friend, uh, Terry Chi. We're, we're in a class at Oakdale U together. We're, we're working on a uh, report. Yeah, nice to meet you. Margo's a detective. Was a detective. It's very nice to meet you. You know, Nikki, uh, your father's over at Barbara's, and he probably won't be back for yeah. a while. Yeah, I, I, I wasn't looking for him. You know, we're just working on a report for general investigative procedures. Yeah, in police work and uh, journalism. I'm an intern at WOAK. Mm. So we figured, you know, since since he's not here, maybe we could just use the office since my dad's out. Well, good. Good luck to you both. But you know, girls, talking about investigative techniques in the abstract is sometimes so difficult. Was there one particular case that you were looking at? We're not investigating anyone in, in, in particular. No. No, just just general investigative procedures. Oh, yeah, in police work, yeah. which is Nikki's interest, or journalism, which I'm going into, after I graduate, and I mean. Oh, good, very interesting. Well, if there's any way that I could help you two out. No, that, thanks, we're, we're doing fine. Yeah, yeah, thanks anyway. All right, well, I'll leave you to your own little... Margo, oh, there you are. You are so early. Uh, no, actually, uh, I can't make the lunch. I have to cancel on you, I'm sorry. Oh, what a drag. Well, make it some other time. But I am going to see you after after group, right? Uh, no, I'm, I'm not going to go. You're not? No, I, it's been one of those days. I'm really swamped at the office. And um, besides, I, I don't think I'll miss it. I actually don't think I need it anymore. Do you think I do? I didn't say that. Margot, I am so glad I went to the Rape Crisis Center. And I can't thank you enough for getting me there. I don't need it anymore. I found someone else I can talk oh, to about all of this. David Allen. Yeah, I, I know what you think about him. It doesn't matter what I think about him. This isn't about him. This is about you. And I don't think that you should quit group right now because you've gone through this trauma. And that I'm not going back. Break. Why? Because I don't want to keep dwelling on what happened to me, okay? I'm over it. I don't, I don't, I don't need to go back. I just want to move on. I want to get on with my life with David. Emily, you're making a big mistake. Margo, I'm not going to stand here while you trash David, okay? This isn't about David. This is about you. you. You haven't known him that long. You don't know anything about my relationship with him. Margo, I know David better than I've known people my whole life. I mean, he's told me things. He's told me very personal things about himself that he's never shared with anyone else. 
Because he trusts me. Emily, trusting someone with secrets is... is right up there with sharing the guilt. No, it's not like that. You don't know, you know what? I don't want to so waste my time arguing me. arguing about David Allen. I just don't think that you should quit group right now. I don't need it anymore. Margo, I have talked and talked about what Diego did to me. And it helped. It did. But I'm all talked out. I, I, I'm I, over it. I just want to move on and forget about it. Well, honey, you're not going to forget about it. I'm over it. I thought I would never trust a man ever again, Margot, and that's all changed. It's changed because of Dave. Yay, good, great. I'm so happy. But Emily, you shouldn't isolate like this. Putting all of your most emotional support onto David Allen, you could go... What do you want me to do? What do you want me to do, out? Mark? Would you like me to keep reliving what Diego did to me for the next 20 years? No, of course not, but if you're in group and you're... Well, then give me a little credit, a okay? I am over it. And I really don't care. 